What's up guys, this is Ken from Ken's How To's and Reviews. So today we're gonna do the last uh, backyard chicken review on Pepper, oh. our olive egger. This great gray gal right here. Um, she's the last of our um, chicken group. We had Louise, she's our Easter egger. Peaches, our Sapphire Gem, and then our other chickens in there. She's probably laying an egg, but um, Pepper is an olive egger. This is her egg. It's a nice olive kind of speckled color and it kind of ranges from really dark olive to the speckled um, color. She lays about 250 a year. You can see the coloring difference on her her feathers. Uh, she is kind of coming at, coming out of molt and um, getting some real pretty dark gray feathers back in. Um, so an olive egger is a hybrid breed, so it's kind of tough to tell the behavioral traits of this chicken. It just really depends on which one you have. Ours is a very quiet chicken um, relative to some of our other ones. Peaches is a little bit of a boisterous um, gal. Pepper kind of minds her own business and stays to herself. Um, just the normal chicken noise is nothing too crazy. No, no outlandish noises, so um, that's wonderful to uh, to have an, in a backyard setting. Um, so an olive egger is basically any chicken that lays a blue egg mixed with a brown egg laying chicken. So there can be various chickens that contribute to this type of hybrid breed. Um, let's see, what are some other, other traits about her? You can kind of tell, uh, I've heard this is kind of a uh, way to tell an olive eggers they have feathers on their feet um, some of our other ones don't so Easter egg or sapphire gem and you can't see now but she does have some feathers on her feet I'm not sure if that's accurate or not or true but um, the guy we got them from said that's how you can tell but um, let's see what else about an olive egger um, I think that's really it great temperament um, again it's a hybrid breed so you don't re really know what you're gonna get until you actually get the chicken and put it in your backyard but um, she really goes well with the rest of the the group and fits in really good with kids and really just minds her own business so um, if you have any questions comments concerns Feel free to like and subscribe, and um, we'll see you next time.